This question is to compute the integral 1 over z squared plus 4 squared dz over the curve c shown here. Very similar to our previous question, we are given the integral function, we are also given the curve c, and it is really difficult for us to find the antiderivative of the given integral function. So we know we are going to use some theorem to help us solve the question. However, in this question, we notice that in the denominator part, there is square there. So we know in this question, we are going to use this theorem. So let the function f be analytic inside and on a simple closed counter C taken in the positive sense. If the point Z0 is any point interior to the given contour C, then we have the nth derivative of FZ0 equals n factorial over 2 pi i times the integral FZ dz over Z minus Z0 to the power of n plus 1. And we know the zeroth derivative of FZ is FZ itself. And 0 factorial is 1. Okay, so the key point is that we need to transform the format of the given integral function into the 1 in that theorem by finding the appropriate point z0 and the fz function. So we can use that theorem. Okay, so in the previous video, we know the denominator part z squared plus 4 can be rewritten as z plus 2i times z minus 2i. And from the given curve, we know the point should be 0, 2i. It is inside the counter c. And correspondingly, we know the fz function should be 1 over z plus 2i squared. And this fz function is analytic inside and on the counter c. And from the denominator part, we have square, so we know n plus 1 should be 2, therefore n is 1. So next, we just need to rewrite this function. So the integral function in the theorem is integral fz dz over z minus z0 to the power of n plus 1. By substituting we have fz equals 1 over z plus 2i squared. We also have z0 is 2i. So we have this. And from the theorem, we know this function equals 2 pi i times the first derivative of fz0 over 1 factorial. And we just need one additional step to figure out the first derivative of fz, which is minus 2 over z plus 2i to the power of 3. So we just substitute the first derivative of z back. We have 2 pi i times minus 2 over 2i plus 2i to the power of 3. Note that 1 factorial is 1. Now we only need to do some simple math. It becomes 2 pi i times minus 2 over minus 64 i. And the final answer is pi over 16. So a brief summary. Next time when we see the question like this, we have the integral function, we have the counter c, and it's difficult for us to find the antiderivative of the given function. We know we're going to use some theorem. And if we see some square or cube, um, there is some power form, we know we're going to use this theorem to figure out. And by finding the appropriate z0 and fz function, and we also need to figure out the n value. We just need to be careful to substitute to solve this question.